and today it is Friday and we're actually gonna go and have some breakfast out today. I am very, very excited for that. We try to at least every two weeks have a nice breakfast out somewhere. I just discovered one of my new favorite places in Barcelona. So if you're living in the city, if you're visiting Barcelona, I highly recommend you to continue watching and save these tips because it's a hidden gem in Barcelona that I absolutely love. But anyway, I haven't talked with you since before I was going to Sweden and it was a bit chaos to be honest. Jay was supposed to leave with me to Sweden on Sunday and we were supposed to spend nine days in Sweden. Since we haven't been there in a long time, we were going to, for a lot of work but also to see my family, my godmother and my friends and everything. But oh, Gerard ended up getting three jobs just this week which was such a pity. I mean super nice for him but we were both like we can't believe it, like all these three in one week. So he came on Wednesday night and left Friday night. But he, he managed to see my mom. We'll have to go back to Sweden very soon. But yeah, I am gonna go and get dressed now and then we are having some breakfast. So guys, here is my look for today's going on a breakfast date. <laughs> like, but I'm going very, very comfortable. This knit is from Monkey and this coat is from Mango. It's quite old. I've had it for a couple of years. This bag is from Pullen and then my jeans are from Monkey as well and a pair of Uggs. As I told you, I want to go very comfortable. situation we have been waiting 15 minutes to be honest we went out a bit too early it opens at 8 30 and uh, we were already there at 8 15 and they hadn't opened so just standing here that is a very nice and kind morning person <laughs> but uh, we're gonna move there right now i think they're open already no in two minutes. and normally in spain it's gonna be five or ten yeah but they have been living in uh, copenhagen and gothenburg these girls. It's a very Scandinavian cafeteria and when I saw it from outside, I think this was like one month ago, immediately thought this looks so Scandi. I, I told them like, I feel like I'm in a Swedish cafeteria. They told me that they had been living in Gothenburg, which is my city, and also in Copenhagen. And the vibes in there are so, so nice and everything is delicious. And every time I've been passing, it's been either closed or it's been full. And it's one of the best coffees I've tried here in Barcelona, so. Oh. Let's go. So here is the place. It's called Raw Studio Specialty in Coffee. And as you can see, there's already people. So here is the menu. And oh, this is the place. How cute this is. Look how nice. It has this Scandinavian vibe to it. And they also have this banana bread that we tried the last time, which was Super, super good. What are you ordering? No idea. I'm gonna have their gluten free bread with avocado, I think. The avocado toast looked so good. Mm. I saw a girl eating it the other day. I just got this candle from one of the girls. How pretty is this? Handmade, it's handmade. Unbelievable, how pretty. So our breakfast has arrived and I have avocado toast with some egg and that has avocado toast with some scrambled tofu. This is Gerard's best friend since he was uh, three years old. This is the girlfriend. We just bumped into her. Today. <laughs> Okay, this looks so, so good. Very juicy. So guys, we are in our apartment now and oh, a lot of things has happened. I am right now in our bedroom and as you can see, we're already choosing the colors of the apartment and I am completely in love with two colors specifically. So I'm gonna show it to you now and let me know what you guys think. So here's the thing, I, I scrolled through Instagram the other day and I found this photo of, I think it was on Louis, one interior designer from, Gotham, uh, from, from Sweden. Always got the burger from Sweden. I really, really like this tone of the bedroom and I felt like it gave a really cozy feeling. So we're between this and this. 
And then in the rest of the home, more neutral besides our guest bathroom, which I'm also going to show you. They also have uh, painted some colors in there. But let me know your opinion. I'm going to take you to the living room really fast and I will show you the colors there. Here we have the five options, the colors that we're thinking for our home. And I feel like this one is a bit too dark, but I really like these two first ones. And I am aware that this gets way brighter once you have painted the whole room, but I really like number two. But please let me know in the, in the comment section which one you think will look nice in the whole apartment. And what I mean with that is like these walls and maybe the living room, the kitchen, let me know. And of course, I wanted to show you this because this has also arrived. I don't know the word in English, but I really, really think that they're so beautiful. Finally, we have chosen this one for our living room. I thought it was so beautiful with the, with the flowers. We also loved this one, but it was a bit too big. We felt like it was more for a home that has maybe a four meter high ceiling. But this one for the bedroom and then this one for the living room. And this is gonna be more or less in the rest of our home together with this. So here we have the colors for our guest bathroom and I really like number seven this one that is here I'll put the floor here so you can kind of imagine how it's gonna look like but yeah with this floor with one type of green color and then where the sink in this is is gonna be a dark like a marble black but yeah let me know which color do you think will go nice in here six to eight and here we have our bathtub it's way bigger than what i expected oh, i'm so happy with me how too big. i'm so happy right it turned out really, i mean i feel like almost both of us fits in here are you still positive that we will move in in april yes i think so too it's looking really really good and tomorrow i'm meeting up with our terrorists to go through some final stuff as well so guys you have to bend because you're not in the so guys we are gonna go home now and later today this guy is going on a bachelor party of my best friend <laughs> yeah. also his best friend was in our home yeah. i was listening to all the games and everything that you're gonna do and uh, i'm just thinking about i hope that you survive to our wedding day because they oh. hate me my friends <laughs> they love you they're not real friends <laughs> I think this. has the sweetest group ever. They have been a group since they were like, some of them since you were one year, two mm -hmm. years mm -hmm. old, and they're still together 27 years later. And I just think it's so, so beautiful mm -hmm. that you still have this. Yeah, it's so You're like brothers, it's crazy. So difficult to find that. Yeah, and they, they, it's, a, it's quite a big group. You're like six guys in it. Yeah. So it's yeah. really nice. Yeah. yeah, super excited, but a tough weekend for me. <laughs> You're gonna have so much fun. Yeah. It's so dry. Yeah, but I'm gonna arrive Sunday super tired, and then Monday back to work. It's, that's the only thing I hate. You can take a bit sleeping more. Sleeping. No, we're shooting the campaign oh, for yeah. the capsule. We have a campaign next time. Yeah, next for the new collection. Stay tuned. Stay tuned. Anyway, guys, let's go home. I need another coffee and we're going to... Oh, oh I'm, tired. I'm tired today. I need yeah, me coffee. too. Super tired. Let's go home. It's time to work a bit. So guys, we are back from the apartment and uh, oh, I am just so excited for it but my head is very very confused regarding the colors because i feel like it's such a big deal the five colors that we have because one of them is going to go in almost the whole apartment and what if that color turns out bad so please please let me know what color you think would look best in our apartment the interior you kind of know my my style and you have seen more or less what we have so what color would go good with the furniture that we have let me know also we're entering a meeting very very soon and it's not a business meeting it is a meeting regarding our kitchen and this is one of the rooms that i'm more excited for i can't wait to have a bit more brighter kitchen and uh, we're gonna see the final design today so very exciting but i am gonna make a second coffee morning i have learned such a nice trick by the way that probably so many of you already know but uh, i'm gonna show it to you anyway just in case so this is the current situation we have one capsule from espresso i love a bit nut flavored coffee and this one is called hazelino muffin and then we have some chocolate drink and some oat milk have to make my favorite coffee so i have poured some chocolate drink in here it's up to you how much you like but i like quite a lot and now it's time to heat it in the microwave and then one shot of espresso in here i'm gonna take a little bit more today than espresso shot because i put quite a lot of chocolate drink and then you pour a little bit of oat milk and a little bit of chocolate drink 
And then last but not least, put all the foam into the coffee. Okay, maybe this doesn't look that good, but it really, really is. It's like a chocolate coffee drink. So with a bit of Baileys, maybe. Mm -hmm. But I highly recommend you try this. If you do this home, you better tell me your stories. Here we have it. Hot chocolate coffee drink. I love all the foam and the creaminess that it gets. Let's try it. Mm -hmm. I'm that right. Let's see what this is. <laughs> It's on my phone, so if it's worth it or not. It's really important. It's, not. <laughs> it's like super important. Don't do it if you don't want to get poisoned. No, it's not. Also, baby, this is like. Also, I feel so proud of this coffee. Can you please try it? First I mean, of all, to... it doesn't look coffee. It yeah. looks like mud. Now, now take the spoon. I just smooth it with the spoon. Also, this is a real thing, okay? What is the form? Is it for me? <laughs> no. Because it's a third coffee. I cannot take it. No, no, it's for me, but you can try it. What did you have? What? what? Oh, you Choc will have to guess. Do we have chocolate? <laughs> you have to guess. How many points? Seven. What? Also, that you're so critical, so. Oh. Okay, five. Oh, five. <laughs> <laughs> just... What a five. Baby. It's too much chocolate. Because I like chocolate. But you don't even feel like it's coffee. You know? You're not supposed to feel. This is for people that does not like coffee and they want. <laughs> just don't drink coffee, you know? <laughs> I think it's easier. <laughs> But uh, you you continue, eh? Trying to guess. I mean, it's good in the beginning. It's amazing, mm -hmm. and then at the end, you feel like too much chocolate. Yeah, because it is chocolate. But good try. Bring the next one. <laughs> There's no next. No, it's really good. But guys, take care with putting too much chocolate, like Emily. Yeah, I mean, I, s I tell you them. You can lower a bit the quantity of chocolate, then it's amazing. Okay. Thank later now and uh, oh i'm gonna show you a small haul together with monkey and i know that so many of you loves this brand and i also love this brand so much and especially when it comes to their jeans the ones i was wearing this morning was from monkey and these are some of my favorite black basic jeans and it's a must for me in my closet but i've also chosen some other pieces that i really really liked and i have a super nice discount code i'm gonna put it here together with the offer that they're having at the moment. And I will of course put all this in the description box as well, together with the links. Let's start this haul. Here are the black jeans that I was telling you about. I love the way these ones fits so so much and they're most perfect basic black jeans and also we have this cardigan it's also from monkey i took it in a size m because i like when it's a bit more oversized but yeah it's just really really nice from this whole haul these are probably my absolute favorite pair of all of them as you know sometimes i like to go a bit more classic a bit more timeless but i also have some days when i want to go a bit more chill and these are the perfect jeans for more chill casual look i love the color and i absolutely love the shape of these ones and these ones are a bit more low rise i can also show you how it looks from behind but yeah these jeans are very very me next up we have these light blue straight fit jeans and they also have a bit lower waist but what i really like with them is this color this is one of my favorite colors when it comes to jeans especially during spring and summer and next up are these beige straight jeans they also have a low waist but imagine this pair with a white crispy shirt during spring or summer such a nice color i really really like it and also this marine blue shirt is from monkey i will link both of these pieces in the description box and if you're looking for the perfect flare jeans i got them for you how nice are these jeans let me get us i love these ones so so nice so guys, the haul is over. I'm gonna put the offer here so you can see it. And as I told you before, everything will be in the description box. And I'll also link the sizes because I know that that helps so many of you when you're choosing. But yeah, I am gonna continue working and later tonight I'm going out on a dinner. So maybe I'll take you guys with me. We'll see. See you in a second.